And welcome to the Colloquium on Research in the Social Sciences and Humanities Student Research Panel. I'm Erin Force, Associate Dean in Georgetown College and advisor to the College Academic Council. The Colloquium on Research in the Social Sciences and Humanities, or CRUSH as we've nicknamed it, has been planned and organized by the College Academic Council since 2017. CRUSH has created opportunities for undergraduates to share their research in a wide variety of humanities and social science disciplines and to learn from their peers. This spring, the College Academic Council faced the unique challenge of mounting CRUSH virtually. Luckily, our students rose to the occasion and submitted their research presentations via video, PowerPoints, and other forms of media. Hi, my name is Maisha, and I am a graduating senior at Georgetown University, double majoring in both psychology and government. My name is Nick Giotis. I'm a first year student here at Georgetown University studying economics and theater and performance studies. Hello, my name is Rachel Singer. I am a current sophomore in the college studying history, medieval studies, and linguistics. Hi, my name is Sonali Mapuri, and I'm a current senior in the Georgetown College, majoring in government and history with a minor in education, inquiry, and justice. My research is of my honors thesis, which looked at predicting procedural justice and legitimacy, youth mental health and wellness for serious juvenile offenders. I will be talking about the culmination of two semesters of independent research and data analysis, the Holistic National Progress Index. And today I'm going to talk about Irish literary influences in an Icelandic saga. For my senior history thesis project, I conducted a micro history of the Ben Ali family, a story of identity formation and negotiation in Washington, DC. What do you plan to do with this? What's the next step? In the future, I'm hoping to um, publish my project, my thesis project, if possible. So my next steps are to learn more of these North Sea languages so that I can do this sort of textual analysis with the original manuscripts. I hope for me that my I can make my research more readily available. There is an archive for Ben's Chili Bowl that I use to do to gain most of the primary sources, so I'm hoping to include it in the archive at GW, um, as well as make it available for um, a diasporic studies because a lot of my thesis talks about um, the South Asian diaspora, so kind of introducing it to different archival websites and reaching out there. Do you have any particular advice that you would offer to your fellow students who want to undertake research? I have two um, big pieces of advice. Like my first advice is I would recommend starting early. My number two advice is uh, do something that you're really interested in because researching is a very thorough project. Um, and my main piece of advice to other researchers would be to ask for help um, because we have wonderful professors at Georgetown, all of whom are professional researchers, and they're always there to point you in the right direction and to tell you when your conclusions are overreaching. If there's one thing that I can say as somebody who did it, it's just to do it. And I think just forcing yourself to sink more time into it. It took a lot for me to like realize that everyone like has their own method of working and I had to readjust mine. So a lot of it is patience and knowing that like it'll end up happening. You just have to like go through the process of it. I want to thank you all for giving us an extraordinary flavor of the broad range of methodologies from data to interviews um, to reading texts um, and exciting like, range of questions um, in research in the humanities and social sciences that are and, and giving us a, a flavor of all of this research that's underway among our undergraduates here um, at Georgetown. So let me wrap up by um, thanking the College Academic Council for its support of undergraduate research. That is incredibly important. By thanking all of your advisors um, for helping you through this. Um, and uh, thanks to you, our audience um, online. But most of all, and especially, thanks to Aaron for putting this together, for helping us uh, bring this together. But for my, to Maisha, to Nick, to Sonali and to Rachel for this fascinating uh, look into your research. It's been a pleasure to listen to these and to have a conversation with you. Thank you.